Yeah, you guys have a new record out after the first time in years. 15 or 16, yep. So, uh, the King in Yellow came out this year. You can get it from our website. So Punk's not dead then? Oh, I hope it is. <laughs> it's because just, it rebottles itself. Yes, it's changed a little bit, yeah, because, but it's still, yeah. it's still around. Because I think Punk it, in a different became, form. Yeah, like Steampunk, they had these really cool bands like, uh, uh, like Rasputina or yeah. uh, Dresden Dolls, and then it mutates off into like all these other wonderful directions. You have like industrial music, so yeah, so it's not dead, but it's mutating like a virus. Hey, would you guys keep it down over there? We're trying to do an interview. <laughs> Turn those amps down. So you guys are, are get, definitely getting a lot of attention here, I've noticed. Some MTV tracking you and stuff like that. They are? Apparently. Apparently. We just talked to. Who was, was that? MTV something or other. Oh my god, I had a chance to be on MTV and I didn't talk about Team Mom. <laughs> I am such a major asshole. I wanted to talk about But knowing that was them, I would have just gone off on Team Mom for like yeah, half an hour. So one of your favorite shows. It's days. the only show I ever see on MTV and I always see it when I'm channel surfing. And it's like if I wake up in the middle of the night and I turn on TV, it's Team Mom. Well, you remember yeah. we're old enough to remember when MTV exactly. actually showed music videos. I wouldn't even say that because it was like Huey Lewis, which is indistinguishable from Team Mom as far as music quality it's like oh look yes and Huey Lewis please please put on a show with Teen Moms yeah I mean I guess it makes sense you yeah. know there's no more Huey Lewis there's no more punk rock girls so <laughs> yeah. what are you gonna do but uh do you guys did you guys do a video for this album or anything or are you no, way we'll over a video. we have some ideas for videos but we haven't done one yet I'm happy now first of all I, every time I want to do a video I did come up with a good idea though with the guy walking the dogs yes, and the yeah. dogs pull his arms off yeah. but um <laughs> No, take it because I'm pretty much like I think I don't know if you ever saw the Angel Spit, Angel Spit Toxic Girl video. There's no more need to make videos. It's an absolutely perfect video. You don't need to do anything else. It's like every time I see something, I'm oh, look, we've done that. We didn't do that. And I watch big videos. So I would like to do a whole big video for the song Caitlin Child someday. But. There you go. So this is it. You guys are doing a big tour, and no, no? it's just we're playing uh, some festivals and weekend uh, getaway kind of gigs. So it's been fun that way. Don't have to ride around in a smelly van for a long time. Although I was saying today, I miss riding around the smelly van. It's like you work really hard to get to a certain point where you have like a you know you're back there in a trailer with all cool bands. And I'm like, I kind of miss it when we were on people's floors and stuff. So I have issues, obviously. Yeah, there's something sentimental there, and maybe you wouldn't miss it for that long, you know? No, I probably, you know, I don't know. <laughs> maybe because I've had that experience. How do you like LA? You guys have any favorite spots out here that you love hitting? Yeah, um, I have like a ton of favorite places. We have a lot of friends from yeah. uh, back in the day out here, so, you know, it's been nice to come out and see them. So. I used to really enjoy hanging out in Hollywood. I actually have a friend that lives out in Hollywood. My favorite thing to do is I like to, I won't get a chance, but I like to go driving up in the hills. And uh, I brought my wife out here a few years ago. She works with uh, animals. She uh, works with the uh, uh, SPCA. And she saw what she thought were stray dogs in Beverly Hills. And she's like, oh, those poor doggies, can't we get out and feed them? I'm like, honey, those are coyotes, all right? In fact, I'm locking the doors now so you don't stick your hands out. So <laughs> I, yeah, I mean, for us, and now they have those giant rats, the, 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 the caballero or whatever. It is that the, it's like the largest rodent on earth, and they've been they, there. A couple, yeah, yeah. They've, they've been found here in the LA. They got a picture, yeah, they got a picture of one of them running around. I'm like, hell yeah, you, you were telling us yesterday about the rats in the, in the palm trees, yeah, the rats in the palm trees. And my wife didn't believe that either. But we're actually right near where we are now. You go down by City Hall at night, and you can hear them up there you can loudly. But when uh, the um, Scandinavian brown rat, I just recently read a book on rats, came and invaded America and pushed the um, indigenous rat further and further west and eventually they couldn't the Pacific Ocean got them so they um, they went up into the trees and that's why you guys have rats in your palm trees now which Philadelphia is so envious of we, we don't have palm trees in Philadelphia we, we have the rats, we have rats. Yeah. Yeah, I'm saying, we had, if we had trees we'd throw rats nice. in I'll have to do a nice photo essay on that yeah seriously check it out and that's uh, the book is uh, um, I think it's called Rats but it's uh, um, really fascinating it has uh, um, the burrows of Manhattan done out in the outline of a rat it's really interesting <laughs> wow, so hopefully that's going to inspire that's your That's the sort son. of stuff I read. <laughs> nice. So, uh, anyone you're excited to see today before you guys play? I've got a ton of people. Yeah, I was like, I want to see Olivia Trump cover control. Really, seriously. I want to catch would... a little bit of off if I can. I want to see no such thing. Uh, uh, I'd like I... to see Guided by Voices. I saw Tijuana Panthers, um, who were great. I saw um, Ty Seagal, who was great. Um, twin Sister were killer. I've been on a roll. So right now it's Olivia.
Olivia Tremor, oh, Colts, I want to see, but Olivia Tremor control and Colts are like right up against each other. Yeah. Yeah, they're like this. It's like plate tectonics. There's, like, <laughs> there's an earthquake, and we just had one in Philly. See, those, they're slipping over each other, and that's what's going to happen. There'll be a tsunami somewhere because they're playing. So, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to see Olivia Tremor control and run to see Colts. I wanted to see, the, I went by their trailer and knocked earlier, but they'd gone outside. Yeah. <laughs> Colts. <laughs> Uh, it's, a, it's a joke, see? Uh, we, we should go out. We should right. Go, yeah. <laughs> Great, well... I wish you'd said uh, They're laughing at home, I guess. They're laughing inside. Cool, well, looking forward to seeing you guys in a few hours, and enjoy the rest of your day. Thank Thanks you. a lot.